And you have 30 seconds to deliver your answer. Now once your 30 seconds are up, you're going to hear this sound. So make every second count, okay ladies? We believe in each of you. So proud of you guys. Let's get started, right y'all? Okay, ladies, good luck. All right, let's begin the Miss Universe Philippines 2024 question and answer segment. And we are starting with you. Ken Robbins. Okay, this is a good one. Are you ready? Women learn from each other. What is the biggest lesson that you've learned from another woman and how did it improve your life? My grandmother put me through school and the biggest lesson I have learned from her is to always be kind. She is someone who has a big heart and took care of me since I was a kid and I do think that my grandmother is someone that I can look up to. She is someone that is an embodiment of what a great woman is. Thank you. Thank you, Kesson Province. Next we have Baguio. Okay, here we go. What is your breakthrough or big achievement and how did it improve you as a person? Being here in this prestigious pageant or the Miss Universe Philippines 2024 is my greatest achievement. The Tara before is someone who doesn't really limit, I who really limit herself when it comes to her achievements. Where I step here, here, here in this Miss Universe Philippines and I see the transformation, the improvement and how I was able to become in, an inspirational woman that I am now. And that is somewhat, something that I will be proud of after this journey. Thank you. Thank you, Baguio. Next, please join me here, Kainta. Thank you. Okay. Women have admired you all throughout your life. Now tell us about how you have inspired another woman. You know, I've been told many times that I am too short to join a beauty pageant. But now I realize that pageants are a representation, a reflection of that very nation. And tonight, I am not only representing myself, but every Filipina woman sees themselves in me. I hope to inspire every Filipina that just like the universe, we too are limitless. Thank you. Thank you, Kainta. Next is... Bulacat. Thank you so much. All right. You are beautiful and confident. How would you use these qualities to empower others? As a woman of color, I have always faced challenges in my life. I was told that beauty is has standard, actually. But for me, I have listened to always believe in my mother, to always believe in yourself, uphold the vows that you have in yourself because of these i am already influencing a lot of women who are facing me right now as a transformational woman i have here 52 other delegates with me who have helped me to become the woman i am thank you thank you bulacan and now Tagi.
Thank you. Okay. Ooh, I like this one. What is the biggest challenge you faced as a Filipino woman, and what do you do to hurdle the challenge? I think one of the biggest challenges that Filipino face today are being limited by still being shadowed by, unfortunately, men or in society. But I think my platform and me standing here in front of you today, I can encourage women that you too can stand up. You can be strong. You can be powerful. You can own your own destiny, like I plan to tonight. Thank you, Tagig. Wow, Alden. Those are some strong answers. Great answers, Jenny. Very quick on their feet. I have to say, ladies, you did an fantastic job. Moa Arena Philippines, that is our top five.